Hello and welcome to Murray Max at Fort Wall Beach. Today I'm going to be going over an exciting new addition to our lot, a 2020 420 Scout. The color combination on this is real nice. I like that dark blue with the cream color. Really, really pops. As we walk down the side of this boat, you can see that it has a step hole. Helps with that, uh, that top speed that you're going to get out of the boat. I just took this over yesterday and got well into the 50s easily great handling boat. As you'll see, we have some great additions up top on this massive hard top. It gives you great coverage when you're out there in, in the sun fishing. You have an open array radar, you have clear, you also have a spotlight in the front as well as some outriggers, so you're already fully ready to go fishing. As we work our way towards the transom, the quad 350 Mercury's, and the previous owner actually went one step above and got them color matched to the boat. Just gives it a really, really nice look. Let's go ahead and hop aboard and I'll, tell you, I'll show you what this thing's all about. So here we are on this massive transom area on the 420 Scout. It also does have some uh, rod storage right here on the back. Right here, easy access for transom walkthrough. We have uh, twin live wells right here, so you can uh, separate your bait for different types of fish and different types of uh, species that you're trying to catch. As you see, we also have easy access to your bilge, plenty of room in there to get to your pumps, anything you need to do there. We also have in-floor fish boxes, port and starboard, so plenty of places to put uh, your catch for the day. One thing I do like, a little addition here that they did, is a uh, fold-out swim platform here falls down, easy access on and off the boat there. As you can see, we do have, this boat is outfitted with Sea Keeper. Excellent addition, makes your day of fishing out there a lot easier. You get back to the dock, you're not all tired out from trying to hold your footing all day. Access to your switches, anything you need to do. A lot of room down there. We do have a prep station here, as well as a sink. As we make our way to the helm, You'll notice that it has uh, two row seating, so you have some room for your guests right here. All these seats do have bolster seating, so you'd be comfortable in multiple positions. I do like the fact that when you actually get these armrests down, you just feel locked in tight. They're really comfortable. If you're making sharp turns, you're barely even going to feel that. You have Mercury Vessel View here, as well as Zip Wake. That's a good addition there for your trim tabs. And my favorite part, triple Garmin setup here. And they all are all integrated, so you can run your radar, your uh, C-Zone, everything through here, even your media. This does have the joystick with Skyhook, which can keep you in place if you're waiting for a spot in the marina and you didn't want to have to worry about the throttles, you just hit that Skyhook and you'll stay in place. Also has a heading hold feature, as well as a course hold feature for your autopilot. As we walk around the starboard side of this uh, amazing vessel, as you'll see, we do have some vertical storage here. Get your brooms, mops, anything you need to do, store it away so it's out of your way. Let's make our way towards the front. At the bow here, you see it's got a very, very nice lounge seat. Two people easily, even three people, if you wanted to go ahead and lay out there. Also, we do have an electronically actuated table. This can go down and sit there, and you'd have a nice sun pad up here as well. Up there is your windless anchor, and you do have your controls up there as well as at the helm. We make our way down the port side, a little feature that uh, has a little bit of a safety for all of your electronics or anything like that you want to keep out of the weather or while you're fishing, don't want them flying around the boat. One of my favorite parts about this boat, you do have a very fully functional cabin here where you can lay out at least three people in the front there towards the bow, as well as you have your uh, burner, your microwave, your sink, and a fully functional bathroom slash wet head. 420 Scout definitely has the comfort in the cabin here. It is a fully functional cabin. You have a spot right here where you can entertain with that table up. If you actually wanted to put it flush there, you do have your filler cushions here and that can make a nice little bed there for about three, four people possibly. You have a nice TV, a little bit of entertainment there, nice lighting if you wanted to light it up at, uh, at night. You have some glass storage here for you know assortment of different glasses that you might need for, uh, for your trip. You do have a, a sink here as well as some drawer storage nice Kenyan cooktop and there is a microwave on this as well as you can see it does have a full full head here with a vacuum flush toilet macerator 
If you come around the corner there, you'll see a stand-up shower. I'm about 5'10", and I can stand in there and be comfortable and not have any uh, issues with the height there. Here, as you can see, you have your entertainment control center. Uh, you can work your Fusion stereo system. This does have a DVD player as well. Generator, you can work all your systems right here if you need to. And then here's your quad ignition panel right here. So if you're interested in coming and checking out this beautiful 420 Scout or anything else we have on the lot, call me at 850-225-9797. We'll see you soon.